Hi, with Solid Performance CRM, we have provided you with default sales dashboard. But apart from that, you can also create your own custom dashboards. If you are creating a custom dashboard, you can include various graphs like bar chart, pie chart, data tables, and donut charts. Let me show you how you can create a custom dashboard as similar to this and how you can also include filters in the custom dashboard. In order to create a custom dashboard, you should have access to hexagon plan. Only then you can create a custom dashboard in your account. In order to create a custom dashboard, go to settings and under settings, you'll be having custom dashboard settings. In here, click on view all and under this, you can add a new dashboard. So let me add a new dashboard as sample lead dashboard and you can also give some reference description. So this will not be used anywhere else. So this is only for reference. Once a dashboard is created, in case if you don't want any other dashboard, you can also delete that. So all these are custom dashboard which are available in the account. And in case if you don't want to have access to it, you can delete that. In case if you want to give access for a particular custom dashboard to your sales team, then what you can do is you can click on this edit and then you will be having option to select the user role to whom this dashboard needs to be available. So if you click on counselor, then for the user role counselor, this dashboard will be visible. But being an admin, all the dashboards are available in this particular account and click on update dashboard. Then this particular dashboard will be visible for that particular user roles as well. You can also select multiple user roles if required. Now, if you come back to the dashboard and refresh the dashboard, you will see sample lead dashboard what we have created, but it will be blank because we have not added any widget. In order to add a widget, again go back and click on the settings. In here, we have provided you with default filters as a widget so that you can enable whichever filters you want to enable. Now, if I want lead filters, I can enable this because I'm going to create a dashboard for the lead module. Now, the beauty with Solid Performance CRM is you can create your own widgets as per your need. In order to add a new widget, click on add widget and then give a title now for example now i just want to create a widget for status in the lead module so i'm just giving it a status i'm mentioning it as status overview and i'm going to select for which module that is the data needs to be derived from which module so if the data needs to be derived from lead module so i'm selecting leads and in which order it needs to be displayed the order basically means if i take this particular test dashboard first second third fourth like that right so in which order this needs to be displayed i just want this particular graph to be displayed as first so i'm just selecting the order as one now i'm selecting for what field now this field can either be a default drop down which is available in the system or even if you are creating a new custom drop down field that also will be visible over here since this is status overview i'm just selecting status again here and then you can select the chart type so we have provided you with options to choose from horizontal bar chart vertical bar chart donut chart pie chart or data tables so i'm just selecting horizontal bar chart over here and you can select the width of this particular chart you can choose the width of the graph so i'm just selecting it as 2 by 3 so that it will come similar to this particular graph and i'm adding this widget so save widget so once the widget is saved you need to enable this particular widget so i'm just enabling these two widgets for this sample lead dashboard and click on save dashboard now i come back to the dashboard and go to sample lead dashboard so you can see this particular graph is created like this you can create multiple other widgets let me add the second widget so i'm just going to add a new widget and this widget name i'm going to keep it as source overview and in here i'm selecting again module as lead and i want this to come as a second one so the field i'm selecting it as source so that the data will be derived from source so the chart type i'm keeping it as pie chart and width i'm keeping it as one by three and save widget once this is saved make sure to enable this and then save dashboard now if you refresh this particular dashboard you will see two widgets are available status as well as source like this you can add up to 10 widgets in one particular dashboard and we have enabled the filter so the filters are also displaying here in the filter the default from and to date will be selected for the current month whatever it is running and you can also change the dates and filter your data accordingly another important advantage of this custom dashboard is you can also bring in your custom reports in this particular dashboard in order to do that again you need to add a widget so give the widget name as sample report or whatever name you wanted and then select the module so in this module you need to scroll down and select custom reports 
Once you select custom report, you can select the order in which you want it to be. And in the field, all the custom reports will be visible. So you can select whichever custom report you want it to be displayed on dashboard and that particular report will be displayed on dashboard. So I'm just selecting executive lead closure report and save widget. I'm enabling this and save. Once I come back and refresh, I can see this sample report over here, which is basically coming from your custom reports. This is how you can easily create and manage your custom dashboards with Solid Performer CRM. You can also keep this particular dashboard as a default dashboard. In order to do that, go to your profile and in here we have provided you with dashboard settings. In this, you can simply select whichever dashboard you want it to be the default dashboard. I'm selecting this and click on save. Now, once this is done, if you come to dashboard, you will see this custom dashboard, whatever we have created as a new default dashboard. So even if you go to deal module and then come back to the dashboard, you will still see this new dashboard, whatever we have created as a default dashboard. I hope I have covered the entire end-to-end -end functions of custom dashboard with Solid Performer CRM. Make sure to use this feature and get benefited out of it as you can see the bird eye view of your business in an easy manner. Make sure to hit the like button if you like this video and subscribe to our channel to get more useful video updates like this. Thank you.